My name is Nancy Silva. I'm from Compton High. I am 18 years old. I'm a senior. And the reason why I'm so into art is because art is some, it's not just like it's not just a hobby for me. It's always been a career that I've always wanted to pursue since I was really little. I've always loved painting, drawing, anything. It just helps me stay calm and happy. And I decided to do this piece because I wanted to make something look dramatic. So I found a picture and I made it my own and I made it dramatic. As well as I could, I made it so dark. It was really fun for me. For now, I'm attending Cal State Dominguez Hills. But I plan to one day transfer either to Art Center or Otis and pursue a career doing art there. Fine arts and maybe even toy design just to have fun with it. Uh, my name is Alejandro Banos. I'm a senior at Compton High School. Um, I'm interested in art because it's a different way for me to express myself without usually being judged or criticized. Like, I really like expressing like myself through painting, which is why I like to do like black and white painting and stuff. And my main focus is doing like horror stuff, um, spooky, like uh, mainly influenced by movies and like things in that area. Well, my main interest is toy design and business, so in the fall I plan to go to UC Santa Cruz and I will be majoring in art and business. I will be doing a double major pretty much. And I want to take a focus in illustration mainly when I go into art, so that way once I graduate from the university I can get a job for a toy company and start designing toys. And if anything I want to get into marketing, that's why I want to take business economics when I go to university. My name is Alejandro Chavez. I'm a senior at Compton High School, and this is my work called Chavela Vargas. And I painted this portrait of my favorite ranchera singer. She's Mex uh, a Mexican singer, and I really it wasn't why I chose this because I really like her emotions, and I like to capture uh, a lot of grief, and passionate uh, gestures, and I like I like the fact that she has she's. Um, an older woman and she's very passionate so she you know she when she, she, she sings she holds on she's a very strong woman and I like to I like to bring out that essence you know that spirit that she has especially when she sings like I like to capture that so if you see a lot of the drapery I did it's very uh, dramatic and that's I love I just enjoy doing you know, dramatic drapery or her clothing and her facial expression all the wrinkles that I one thing I do love is capturing the colors, the strong, warm colors that come out in her face. And I, I, I remember doing this piece for at least three weeks. And I remember the whole time I was just listening to her music, and I think that's what inspired me the most. Having that inspiration and that influence. And with all my work, I do the same. You know, I would do a portrait. I don't do just anybody. I do it with somebody who has that spirit. And I think that's really important. Well, recently I was accepted to Art Center College Design with a full scholarship and majoring in fine arts in the fine arts department with illustration major. And I plan to get my MFA. Hopefully continue, you know, going to school for a couple of years. And hopefully I want to become an illustrator and a fine uh, fine arts uh, gallery artist. And I just hope that my career has something to do with art. You know, that, that's the reason why I got into art center because it's such a good 
school and it really pushes you in the industry. So that's one reason why I one reason why I want to go there is because they offer the opportunities and the career choices that I want to do, like illustration. And just explore and just travel and get to know other artists. Hello, my name is Adele Barajas. I'm a senior at in high, high School, 12th grade. This is my artwork here. Uh, I like to do a lot of pencil, but recently I've been getting into a lot of pastels and a lot of single-stroked uh, artwork pieces like this one. Uh, I really like the, the isolation in pictures, so a lot of my pictures show maybe just one focus of a character or a person or a face. It really shows like that focus, that that um, insight in a person where you could just see into their eyes and look at their soul. <laughs> That's a little deep, but it's true. Um, now that I'm getting into pastels, I'm experimenting with color. It's, it's amazing. Uh, color is just, now that I'm messing with color, it's like just explosions of like warm, hot, like hot reds and cool blues. So you'll never, almost never see me use black. I plan to. So I'm going to Fullerton. I'm getting a, a my major is art and it's in illustration. I'm planning to work in the in entertainment industry, either illustrating for graphic novels or maybe just as a freelance artist for some time. Maybe I really wanted to to get into uh, gaming or concept art for movies. Pretty much the whole entertainment industry. Yeah. My name is Giovanni Juarez. Uh, I'm in the 11th grade. And, well, I started actually getting into art this year. I took uh, art class last year, but by chance, just because it was the only class available, and I ended up liking it. So, so I uh, practiced a lot. I challenged myself. Now I'm here with AP Studio Art, and hopefully I get like a good grade on my portfolio that I had to send in. But. I experimented a lot this year with faces. I threw in color in there because I saw everybody doing it. I was like, oh, maybe I can do this. So I started doing it. I messed with charcoal, black and white, high contrast, all of that stuff. And I just enjoyed myself. I feel like, like there's nothing else in the world when I'm, when I'm drawing or painting. So I think it's like really cool that you know, there's something that makes me feel that way. So I spend a lot of time on this now, rather than just uh, playing video games like I used to. I think it's a really cool, I want to go to the art center when I graduate next year. Uh, so hopefully I can get grants and scholarships for that, with my work. And uh, yeah. My name is Arturo Torres and I'm a senior at Captain High School. Um, for my artwork, I basically focus on something that I always loved since I was a little kid. For instance, I, always, I love dragons a lot, so for this class I drew 12 of them in order to, um, to see what I already know and how I can use my ideas of what I learned from this class and from past years that I have with him. 
Uh, out of all of them that I actually done, this is my favorite because this is my very first one that I actually did. And they actually came out pretty good for my first time. But since this is my first one, and I didn't have much practice in yet, it took me like a couple of weeks, like two or three. After this, everything else came out easy. So everything came out like around a week, maybe three days to finish everything else. After I graduate from Compton High, I'll be going to Cal State LA and pursuing my, dream, my degree in game design. Hi, my name is Lucky from you. I'm in the 12th grade. I'm currently a senior here at Compton High School. Uh, as you can see, my artwork, my, one of my favorite pieces here, um, something that I really inspired my, uh, myself to draw and share with my uncle, Hagos. He has uh, been a real inspiration to me, especially in the art world, because also he's an architect and also he does art too. Um, some of my, or one of my future aspirations in life is architects architecture and that's what I will continue to do at North, uh, Cal State Northridge and uh, I've been accepted there uh, for ride so that's it Shantae Baskerville and I'm a senior here at Compton High School. Um, what I like about my artwork is that I can use colors to bring my artwork to life, which I always loved. Since my future dream is to become an animator and I want to get better so I can achieve that goal. And so throughout the years of Mr. Palmer, he taught me how to use more detail, how to make your pictures pop out more, how to put more effects to it in a way. And so what I learned from him was that it was He's an encouragement, an inspiration to me, and I've known him since middle school when I was taking art classes at that time, so it's been a really great adventure with him, in a way. I plan on attending Otis College of Art and Design, and my dream career is to become an animator, since it was the first thing I've seen as a child, and like, it just enticed me to become more like people who make those shows. Hi, my name is Grecia Ramirez, and I'm a senior at Compton High School. Um, my artwork is mainly mainly focuses on animals. They're all in uh, colored pastels. Uh, I have a few um, drawings of people, but my main focus is animals. My plans for the future is to go to uh, UC Merced and study biological sciences to be a veterinarian. And my artwork sort of reflects that because it shows my passion for animals. and I'm a senior at Compton High. Uh, I focus mainly on body works, body, black and white bodies. Um, I prefer it just because I like shadows and I really like how, I, I just like black and white, it's a lot easier for me and I love how the shadows have different shapes and sizes and it's, it's very, it, it brings out more in me, I like it a lot more. For the future, um, I plan to enroll on to Dominguez, um, Cal State Dominguez Hills and minor in art and major in psychology.
my name is Oscar Solares. I'm a 12th grader at Compton High School, and these are my pieces. When I thought of doing my pieces, it came from my mind and myself. So basically, I didn't take nobody's idea. I just made it my own. I used my own models and everything. I really expressed myself on all these pictures that I have here. And this is my beginning because further on, I'm gonna try to make it better. I, I got the saying like, I'm good with my hands. So I'm like, hmm, hands, right? So it's like, basically each hand has like a characteristic. One's cheating, that's kind of reminds me of when I used to cheat. And playing piano, instru uh, instrument, a person that plays instruments, and like somebody that catches the ball, you know? Feel very proud of themselves, you know? My plans for the futures right now is like, I, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna attend uh, to Santa Monica College and transfer in two years to I'm gonna try to transfer to Otis. And from there, I'm just try to get a great art job. Stephanie Martinez. I'm a senior here at Compton High School. I'm in Mr. Palmer's AP Studio Art class. And well, my artwork is influenced a lot by like science fiction and my favorite things and my favorite show is Doctor Who. So I have an ood from Doctor Who. Um, after high school, I'm hopefully planning on going to an art school. I'm gonna submit a portfolio to hopefully get a scholarship to Otis. So and continue on, um, maybe get uh, some kind of photography degree or maybe drawing and painting. about this show today is that these kids four five six years ago were in middle school at my class seventh and eighth grade they come over here 9 10 11 12 they probably miss a year or two right but they get back they get serious they get focused they do their AP portfolio mm -hmm. and they're set so it's like Palmer created this bridge program for the arts he's pretty much like the the main guy that I really reported to to get all this stuff started with working with eighth graders to prepare them to to come here at Compton High School. And he's still standing and he's still running. And Yeah, so basically what I do is prepare these kids uh, at a middle school level in art, uh, going over the elements and the principles of design, teach them all the basic foundations. So when they come here, they're like armed, they're ready to go and paint and draw. And then Palmer takes them to that next level, preparing them for college. Yeah, so and constantly the students are constantly uh, you know most of them they still meet with Aguilera help them out with projects and things like that um, also they're able to take me like each consecutive year especially the ones that are serious and then once they get to that certain point like maybe 11th or 12th grade they're able to uh, go to any college of the choice because the foundation that uh, Mr. Aguilera and myself has provided for the students so he comes by the classroom a uh, couple visits a year and then teaches them the basic stuff to be ready for this class to take it seriously and then they go on from there. I mean the bottom line, and I think this goes along with the math, English, science, what have you, that all the energy and the creativity is in the, in the seventh and eighth grade. They lose it when they come here. That's because they don't know anything about you know, the high school campus. 
So I will go over there and meet with them. And when they come over here, it's like business as usual. So they don't have to really reinvent themselves. They can just go ahead and just carry on to what we had already in the eighth grade. And it's been very successful every time we do it. And I have uh, Mr. Aguilera to really thank for that, thank for that, because that's, I mean, his cooperation really, really helped. Yeah, that's basically it. He's a recruiter and the coach. That's right. Go Vapa. Hello. <laughs> My name is Wes Hall. I'm a former art director and art instructor. And uh, I think I've had the opportunity to instruct and guide some of the most talented high school and college art students in the United States. I always tell the students that um, if you want to major in art, uh, five of the top 10 schools in the United States is right here in Southern California. And uh, I'm just so glad that they're taking advantage of that, upping their skills, and Mr. Palmer's doing a super job here. And it's, it's, it's rather than just remain uh, a stalemate, like so many of the same number of students going into these schools, the, they're, they're increasing their numbers. And the city of Compton should be proud of them. Uh, the art industry is very proud of the students from Compton. And um, uh, those students, uh, the thing I like about the students is they're coming back and helping some of the younger students that are still here and helping them into careers. And that's what, I think that's what I was basically about, having students get into a career and motivating them to stay there. If you just look around, if you saw the show, and I think you saw some of the exhibition by the high school students uh, out there, um, they're, they're not second to any school in the country. But when you put, a visual take on architecture and you join that with uh, with a painted illustration uh, I think that's Alejandra yeah. she's sort of resting on top of Compton High School uh, that's putting it all together and that's what the colleges and uh, the training centers are looking for someone that can just go a little bit beyond norm the norm and do something that skillful and it's easy to see when they go to these colleges with their portfolio, once you open up and see something like that, uh, that college will probably snag, snag you before another college gets a chance. Uh, but her work is outstanding. And there are some really creative uh, work that they're doing. And what I like to see uh, out of a high school student is take chances. Do great artwork with great skill but uh, don't duplicate, just uh, do something different and see how well your skill can, can visualize what you're thinking. Um, because uh, everybody will see art in a different light. And I work for Congresswoman Janice Hahn, who represents the 44th District of California, which is part of San Pedro, Wilmington, Compton, Watts, Southgate, Linwood, and part of Long Beach. Your Congresswoman, Janice Hahn, is very proud of the Compton School High School because we have had some great talent coming out of Compton. And so we want to recognize you kids that have stuck it out like your teacher said because anything takes great perseverance and challenge to stay you know, committed to doing something. So I want to recognize 12 of the students that participated in this art gallery. So can Nancy Silva please come up? <laughs> on behalf of Congressman Janice on the Certificate of Congressional Commendation to you on the occasion of the Compton High School Wells Hall Gallery, the fifth annual senior art show. It gives me great pleasure to salute and commit and dedication to the arts. Best wishes and great success. Thank you. You're welcome. So let's have Giovanni Juarez come up. Yay, Giovanni. On behalf of Congresswoman Janice Hahn, it gives me great pleasure to present the certificate to you on all your hard work. So, thank you. All right.
Shante, can Shante please come up? Yay, Shante! Woo! On behalf of Congressman Janice Honig, it's a great pleasure to present the certificate for you. And all your hard work and your talented, very talented. Thank you. Congresswoman Janice Hahn for your art and for your talent, your being talented and be, being very special. So thank you All so right. much. Thank you. Adwell Barajas. Yay! Congresswoman Janice Hahn, it gives me great pleasure to present the certificate to you for all your hard work. Thank you so much for sticking it out with, with these guys. Thank you so much. You're wonderful. Right. Uh -huh. You want to get a picture? Lucky, L-A-K-E-A, yay! Janice Hahn, it gives me great pleasure to present the certificate to you for all your art and, and what you've done. So, congratulations. Oscar, can Oscar come up? Oscar, on behalf of Congresswoman Janice Hahn, it gives me great pleasure to present this nice certificate for you for all you've done, for participating in this art gallery, and good luck in your future, too. Yay, you're welcome. All right, let's do it. Okay, we'll get Grisia. Grisia? Yay, Grisia! Yay. Oh, Grisia, Grisia. On behalf of Congresswoman Janice Hahn, it gives me great pleasure to present the certificate to you for your dedication and for your, all your hard work towards doing art. So, congratulations. Thank you. All right. All right. Kimberly! <laughs> Kimberly, I present this certificate to you on behalf of Congresswoman Janice Hahn for your great being so talented and wonderful and participating in the art show. Thank, so you, thank you so much. Yeah. You're beautiful. Yeah. Congratulations. Yeah. Stephanie, can Stephanie come up? <laughs> Janice Hahn, it gives me great pleasure to present the certificate to you on all your hard work and your dedication and being an art student. So thank you so much. Thank you. All right. All right. I'll get a hug. <laughs> you want to get a picture? Last but not least, can I have Alejandra Chavez come up? Before I give this to Alejandra, a lot of you guys know, we had our Congressional Competition Art Show uh, last month, and Alejandra won second place. And her picture, her art piece, which is here, I want everybody to see it, and I'm sure you all have, it's going to be hanging in our Congressional office in Washington, D.C. So we're very, very proud of Alejandra. We're proud of all you guys representing Compton, Compton High School. So we know great things are gonna come out of you kids. So be encouraged. So we, we really love you and care a lot about you. So thank you again. Here's another message.